Dobro večer, dragi naši. Evi deneska, da vi pozdravim, so naši od hristijanski pozdrav Ristos Vrskrese. Prekrasen den, što go očekujeme cela godina, da go dočekame srekni veseli, no za žal, denešnji od den dojde crn den za sti makedonci, sti ti hristijani, koji što se najduvajte ovde, kaj v Sidnej, može biti to, ki se čuje na sekade. Momentalno se najduvajme v naselbata Rogdel, kde što se nalga našta pravoslavna hristijanska crkva Sveti Hristovo Vaskresenje. Točno, ime to odgovara za ova crkva i deneska beše Hristovo Vaskresenje. Nažalos, našata pravoslavna crkva se razpadna, pregoli mi jazici od plavnih Zameni je rasturnaja, je izgorja. Devet i pol satot, otprilika, beše razpadnata, veke krov odpajgaše, a lujge to iznemošteni, od site strani, go gleda ovaj tragičen nasan za site nas što ne opvati. Ovi težok požar beše zafati na okolo devet i pol satot. Može bi tleše v vnetrešnosti na crkvata, no najgolemite jazice se pokažaja okolo 9,5 satot. Znači, ova naša prekrasna makedonska crkva završi na dnoto na zemljata se sramni. Žalosno je, ovaj prekrasen grad, što go fati ova teška nesrejka, ki je osetime site na našte makedonski srca. Evi da vidime na okolu, ima poveke od 20 godina, požarnikarski koli, potoa imame ambulanti, mnogo imame policijski auta, narodet na okolo je nasobran, znači sve to je v golema depresija. Da vidime što ki se sluči ponatamo, to ki kaže samo to vreme, no momentalno imame golema ošteta, sve ušte ne znajme koliko košta. Ki se vidi, može bi v odutri natamo, zavisi koja ki se rešat našte najgolne prašanja. Tukaj postoji dokumentacija, tukaj postoji našte tradicionalni freski, ko što ne posejkat na prošlosta, na segašnosta, vse to na što ni leži na srce, nije ve ki go izgubivme. Da li ova crk kaj ki stani na noze ušte naš, vse ušte ne znajme, draj gledači, da vidime što ki sluči. A nije, makedonce sme jaki lujge, ne se predavame, vse ušte sme jaki in mislime, da ka ponovo kaj izdignime. Sni izdignali mnogo crkvi. Ete, našto srce je mnogo jako. Da vidime ponatamo što ki sluči. burning smoke we thought it could be a uh, smoke of the barbecue or the fire could have break into the house but after maybe 20 to 25 minutes later we all could hear the siren of the fire brigades and the police car they just constantly were coming through and then all of a sudden all of us just uh, standing outside the restaurant or outside the house first of all we couldn't see the smoke and then the huge flame then the huge flame was they couldn't stop it. Around 30 to 35 firefighters they came from all over the Sydney and us as all we can understand. And halfway through of this Frederick Street Road was completely blocked. 
what they did uh, like I was really shocked because my concern was for the nursing home which, which was which is just a couple of seconds away from the church they saved the many old age people just imagine in this wintry night so first couple of firefighters they were stopping the fire and couple of instead of stopping uh, uh, the fire couple of them were just trying uh, to stop the fire and they were giving the water to the other side of the building to the wall of that all the other side of the building so that the fire can can't reach to the nursing home walls and few of the homes so that's what I heard that maybe two or one unit just had got a little bit of damage so the closest uh, the buildings uh, were evacuated so all the people with the children and the old age people they had to came all around from that area and and they had to sit around for a couple of hours so you, you work at the rest home no 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 i work in another nursing home yep. and we were all between like you know even from sydney even from far away from sydney they could see the blazing flame and all when i was coming through and i could see the flame i was really scary and I, we were all guessing hope they shut down the electricity so the damage cannot go through that far it was in my entire life in sydney i haven't seen such a massive huge fire in my life just one final question um, yeah did you did you get here before the fire brigade got here or like did you i i we got it so after finish because i'm the registered because after finish my shift and 9 30 uh we i finished my shift and i just stopped in there so when I was coming to all I can smell the, all we can smell the barbecue. We thought it could be the barbecue, maybe the fire has been broke inside the house, could be. But after just 25 minutes later, all the thick, large black smoke, it was, you could feel like it's a foggy, wintry morning. So if you if you're a point over there, you're a point over to the building. Yeah. Right. Um, where could can you tell us where roughly um, where the biggest flame for you is seen? Yeah. The right, uh, right, out, the, right in the, the middle. Tree, out above the tree, and the all blazes like you know that uh, when the we didn't know that that actually that actually happened in the church because we were all guessing there is a school, there is a church, and there is a nursing home. Which one got? No, Lucky we were finger crossing. Yeah, it was the church. church. Finger crossing. Hopefully, it, it couldn't be destroyed. The whole nursing home. That was our point. And when the blaze was all coming through, and it was coming on above the tree, uh, probably I'm not sure, but guessing it could reach around 100 meters above the last one. And from some other outsider, as like us, and I, I heard that. Uh, when the last or uh, two fire brigade came, uh, the two strong, uh, I think one or two gas explosion, mommy, like you know, the rest of whatever was left inside, they all heard the boom. We all heard the boom. So which was was inside, we don't several know, but we all heard the there, several explosion, the sound of several right. huge explosion. And all we could see after 20 to 25 minutes later, the blaze was just Starting, staring up above the sky, above the tree. The tree. Yeah, yeah, including the tree. The, there was a burning. The and tree was the, burning. The, the huge oak tree on the front yeah, of the yeah, yeah, well. yeah. It burned. It was it, it, it was burning. The part of the tree was because burning. It was all. Yeah. 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 She was here too. Yeah, we she have knew. footage actually. Um, so you guys, we, did you guys see it before the fire brigade got here? Yeah. 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 Okay. Well, so some, what, did you, some, yeah. what did you guys see on the the effect of the actual fire? It was crazy. Like, what, what did you see? It was just all smoke first. Yeah, all smoke smoke smoke. yeah for a few so minutes, how long? You know? How long after the fire began? The emergency services got here. Did the uh, rest well, there were some the rest already. There were about two or th um, there were two about or three two. minutes. Within ten two. minutes, and because the closest one is in the enclave. Yeah. That you know, um, that forest road, you know, near the yeah, the yeah. closest the closest one is the enclave, and I think within ten minutes. We all could hear the siren, obviously. Yeah, boom, 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 boom. I think almost one from one all around two. the Sydney, yeah. the fire brigade just came around. Like yeah. Just fire brigade came so around. So the is just yeah.
U zadnjem je se nalaga jedan starački dom koji što je prilepen, skoro prilepen do našta crkva koja što uvijek je završio plamen i u ovoj starački dom se smesteni povijek je naši makedonci koji što živijaju tuka najnormalno i Vesta je što jedan od njih završil u bolnica kada što je transportiran za teško dišenje. Dvajca svedoci koji što go nabljudija ovoj golem požar, pa momentalno bi sakali da ga zaprašame bar jedno do dve prašanje da vidime vo što se raboti robotata. Can you tell us the first time how you see the fire? Yeah, we was coming down from back of Rogdal. Yes. And then we find the smoke, but we didn't know from where until we passed the street from beginning of Frederick Street. My son, he was driving. Yes. He can't see probably when he was drive until he found the church it was a fire coming out very heavy from the church. And he said, Mom, the church is, is in fire. We stopped the car and we went out to ring the police. I ring the police. The police passed me to the fire to get the address. I didn't know the address. I ring up the people in the nursing home next mm -hmm. door. The fire was already very, very heavy. That was 9.30, between 9.30 and 9.40. And then I ring up the nursing home to say to tell them that there's a fire next door to you. And the lady, she said, we cannot do anything until the police can. The police, I just five minutes, I found the, um, the, the fire uh, truck came and they started to do the evacuated for the nursing home. And we stopped for three hours now until the car in front of the, uh, in front of the church. And then we just, as we waiting to see what's going on after the so data. Here. Yeah, we, yeah, we, no, we cannot move. My son, he's got an exam tomorrow and uh, we was, you know, after, sorry. yeah, no, that's okay. But uh, we feel Sometimes sorry for, for the church. Yeah, we feel sorry for the church. It's, it's our God's house, you know what I mean? Right. It yes. is no good to see something like this and to leave it. That's and right. we started to, to stand next to them until we find out what's going on, until they put the fire down. Oh, and that's, much for your and that's okay. You're welcome. Have You're welcome. Night. Thank you. You, you too. Thank Don't you. Don't be cold. <laughs> no, no, it's okay. U zadnjem mjene se nalaga jedan starački dom koji što je prilepen, skoro prilepen do našta crkva koji što uvijek je završio plamen i u ovoj starački dom se smesteni povijek je naši makedonci koji što živijaju tuka najnormalno i vesta je što jedan od njih završil u bolnica kada što je transportiran za teško dišenje. Se sretna vušte so jeden svedok na ova tragična neslika i bi sakala i ovaj mlad čovek da ni kaže otprilika da li nešto videl. Dobro večer i kako se vikate? Ja sam Aleksandar Boševski. Da, poveli. Da li imate neko ideje kako se sluči to? Ne sam ja stopo sigurne. Ама сестра ми се јави, ми рече дека црквата е запалена, јас он ме излегов тука блиско живеем и он ма дојде втука, ама и тоа е тоа, дојде втора видам, се тоа запалено, многу ми беше чудно, знаеш, многу жалност, се како како може ова на велики да се случи, многу ми е чудно и многу ми е жалност дека сум 
знаеш, чисто македонец и многу ми е, знаеш, фака, не знам, не можам да спијам. Имам работа во шеста бајли, ама не можам, вечер нема да спијам. За НТВ, Марија Александрова Цветановска, од срцето на Рокдел.